I've been doing something that's very simple that has brought me from point A being a very, very messy person, overwhelmed by mess, depressed by my mess, to point B of being relatively effortlessly tidy, clean, and on top of my environment. The trick is, at the end of every workday, I set a timer on my phone for 20 minutes, and I spend that 20 minutes cleaning and tidying. So I'm gonna take you on a little, little tour of terror, show you uh, my apartment. Here's the sci-fi place. All of my, uh, well, not all of my sci-fi books. That's about maybe 60, 75% of the sci-fi books that I have. Let's see here, some Ikea bags. There's my uh, workstation there, table. There is my bed, there's the ground, there are my other books, bunch of stuff on the counter there, bunch of stuff on the floor, there's the work area. Here's the kitchen, we have an array of dishes here. Uh, this is a, a actually fairly clean, this is not so bad. And bathroom, not so bad either. So it's really just this living room and that stock room is a disaster. That's beyond the pale. That's where I keep most of my inventory. That's a bigger project. So I'm just gonna set a timer for 20 minutes. I'm gonna put this camera on a tripod and I'm gonna show you the before and after. my progress. I gassed out at around 15 minutes. I kind of ran out of things just to easily tidy. And then I wound up taking another extra couple steps to correct some things that I knew needed correcting. Specifically, I had this Brita filter. Where is it? Just sitting on top of my microwave for like three months not being used. Why was it there? I don't know. I feel we need to address something at this point in the video, which is that I appear to have a gigantic booger in my mustache while talking about the importance of cleanliness. A beta male would not release the booger tape. But you know what? A wolf does not concern itself with the opinions of sheep. So if you're triggered by the booger, then why don't you go back to... So if you're serious, about learning and reselling, and you're not a snowflake, then keep watching. So I put it there to be, to be dealt with. I also processed more of my sci-fi mountain. I added a couple more of these titles, the ones that I bought today very foolishly. Uh, those are up there now to be read sometime about 100 years from now. All right, desk, pretty much the same. That's always kind of in a, a static state of clutter. The table, I'm still working on that shirt, so that's gonna be there. This is still active inventory, so that's gonna stay there. Otherwise, made the bed, more or less, kind of tidied up the bookshelf a little bit, uh, cleaned off the counter, and there's a couple things, but I'm gonna get to that. That stays there. The work area, basically the same, tidied up a little bit. I'm still working on this inventory. Kitchen, looking better. Sprayed the countertops, all the dirty dishes into the dishwasher and hand washed some dishes that are in there. Sprayed those countertops. All the stuff on the floor is now gone. And the bathroom, tidied it just a little bit. I can wake up tomorrow and not trip over a bunch of stuff and, and feel overwhelmed like a moron. And uh, that's what I feel like I have been. It's a moron for not doing this. I'm maybe like giving very remedial tips. So if this is duh to you, then congratulations. But this is like genuinely kind of life altering that I've done this, uh, been doing this. 
and it has a direct impact on my business too. I just feel alleviated psychologically on some level, uh, not having to live in a cluttered place. And the psychological burden of being a full-time reseller is heavy. Heavy hangs the, uh, the $5 Goodwill crown. Um, but this, this helps, this makes a, a difference. Hope I'm not being redundant. I owe a couple of thank yous. A belated thank you to the person who bought me Metallica's Kill 'Em All off of my Amazon wish list. This was from Belinda. Thanks very much. You bought this for me like two months ago and it pretty much just arrived. And I contacted Amazon and got them to give you your money back. Uh, thank you, Deb, for this Gojira album. It's incredible. She says, love your videos, tons of great tips and content. Thank you so much for all you do. We shop at the same thrift stores. If that's true, Deb, please say hello. Appreciate it very much, guys. Hope this helps.